Lee Minho and Minha Kim explain why their drama pachinko is for everyone. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today, we will discuss the most anticipated drama series of the year, Pachinko. Here is what the star cast Lee Minho and Kim Minha said about the drama. Now, before we continue with the video, have you subscribed to our channel yet? If not, then what are you waiting for? Smash that huge red subscribe button on your screen. Also, while you are at it, don't forget to hit the bell icon to never miss out on any of our videos. So without further ado, let's get started. Now, a little background information first. The drama is based on a novel by the same name. It is airing on Apple TV. The first three episodes aired on 25th March 2022, and now there should be one episode released every week. The last release date of the drama is estimated to be on 29th April. It is a multilingual drama. This means that there are three languages spoken in this very drama. The languages are Korean, Japanese, and English. The subtitles for these are represented in different colors. English has white colored subtitles. The subtitles for Korean are shown in yellow, while the Japanese ones are in blue. The cast is as starry as it can get. First, we have the Oscar winner Yoon Yoo Jung as the protagonist Sunj. Then we have Kim Minha playing the teenage versions of Sunja. Then I have the little Yuna playing the kid versions of Sunja. To avoid confusions in the comment box, this is a small kid Yuna, guys not Yuna from Itzy, just to avoid confusions in the comment box. Then we have the ever-famous Jim of the Hallyu world who has carved his place in the hearts of every generation. The one and only Lee Min-ho. He is a merchant who frequently travels to Busan in South Korea and those who have read the novel knows everything about his character Ko Hansu. We also have Soji Arai playing a very important role in Baek Muzazu. He is the son of Baek Isak and Sunja and the person who later turns to whole game. The title guys hold a lot of importance. It is the primary instrument to reserve their fortune, and also their whole life seems like a game of pachinko. The story is based on Sunja, a girl born in Japan-occupied Korea. The drama revolves around her struggle to earn a living in the world. The acting seems really powerful so far. Well, they really have a great cast as the driving force. Then. If you look closely, there is not much physical similarity between all the three sunjas, but their emotions and the grit to do well in life resonates within them. The drama is supposed to be divided into 8 episodes. This is pretty small for a Korean drama. They usually have at least 2 episodes if there is some issues with the screening and production. Else, they are typically divided into 16 or 32 episodes depending on the streaming platform. Now the cast member Lee Min-ho and Kim Min-ha were in an interview promoting their recent show. So when asked about what they think of the drama and since it is based on Korean history, there will be anything of relevance for the rest of the world. Lee Min-ho answered in a very beautiful way. Now he said that everyone who will watch this drama will be able to relate to it. The focus of this drama is not on the Korean and Japanese rift, but the people in Japan and Korea. How war can affect not just some, but all the people of the country. There are themes like how love and sacrifice made by people even during tough times like war can change their luck. This is one of the prime themes of the show. There are historical events that have been taken into account. Still, the producers have given any importance to how these affect the ordinary people and how their struggle to earn and sustain themselves increases. The central theme in the drama for Minho was those that transcended borders and time, those that do not see nationality or era. So we can expect a lot of gripping plotlines and emotional themes in a drama. Well, it shouldn't be a surprise since we are talking about Minho here. 